After exploring the Earth, humanity has turned its attention to the stars. Our thirst for space exploration and pushing the boundaries of science will see us going deeper into our solar system. Here are some of the ambitious future space missions that will help us understand the very fabric of the universe and inspire the next generation of space scientists. Number 10. The James Webb Telescope will finally begin its mission in 2021. The James Webb Space Telescope is set to be the successor to the Hubble Telescope and has a planned launch date of 2021. NASA has completed the construction of the hardware and is currently testing it on the ground. Webb will be launched with the assistance of the European Space Agency who will provide the Ariane 5 rocket to send the telescope into Earth's orbit. The James Webb Space Telescope will be more powerful than its predecessors and will be able to see further into space to discover distant planets in far-off galaxies. It will even give us the tools to search for indications of an atmosphere in exoplanets that could sustain life. Number 9. India's first human space mission in 2022. The Indian Space Research Organization is planning to send the first group of Indian astronauts into space between 2021 and 2022 for a duration of approximately a week. Four astronaut candidates have been selected for their first human mission, one of which will be a female military pilot. India has been developing its own crewed spacecraft, this spacecraft would let two to three people orbit Earth on a week-long space flight. Number 8. SpaceX to launch a mission to Mars in 2022. Elon Musk's ultimate goal is to colonize Mars. He founded SpaceX as he was frustrated that NASA wasn't doing more to get people to the Red Planet. He wants humanity to be a multiplanetary species. SpaceX plans to launch at least two uncrewed cargo ships on the Red Planet before sending any humans there. These cargo missions would bring supplies such as life support systems and power generators, that stuff would be needed for humans to build facilities that can generate power, gather water, and bottle up the thin Martian air. SpaceX wants to use water ice from the planet's surface and carbon dioxide from the Martian atmosphere to refuel starships on Mars. This will enable the rockets to return to Earth. In 2024, Musk wants SpaceX to send a crewed spacecraft to Mars with the primary objectives of building a propellant depot and preparing for future crew flights. Before we continue further, be sure to subscribe to our channel, that way you won't miss any of our weekly videos. Number 7. China to launch a third space station in 2022. China reached a historic milestone by landing the Chang-4 spacecraft on the far side of the moon. This is an exciting outcome because the Chang-4 landed in the moon's oldest and deepest crater which may be able to shed new light on the moon's origins. The country of more than 1 billion isn't stopping there. China now plans to begin fully operating its third space station by 2022, to put astronauts in a lunar base by later in that decade, and to send probes to Mars, including ones that could return samples of the Martian surface back to Earth. After more than 10 missions for construction and in-orbit assembly, the station will be shaped like a T, with a core module, called Tyan, at the center, and one lab capsule on either side of that. The space station will offer up to 5,650 cubic feet of living space across the three modules. That's a little more than one-third of the space on the International Space Station. Number 6. SpaceX's First Moon Tourism Trip in 2023. Japanese entrepreneur, designer, and art curator Yusaku Mizawa will be the company's first private passenger to fly around the moon in 2023. It will make use of a SpaceX Starship on a private space flight flying a single lunar trajectory around the moon. He would invite six to eight artists from around the world to join him on the trip. They will be asked to create something after they return to Earth. These masterpieces will hopefully inspire the explorers within all of us. SpaceX said it is an important step toward enabling access for everyday people who dream of traveling to space. However, Mizawa won't be the first ever space tourist. In April 2001, Dennis Tito spent eight days on board the International Space Station after paying the company Space Adventures about $20 million for the trip. Since Tito's expedition, six other individuals have paid to fly on a Russian capsule to the International Space Station. Number 5, 
Asteroid Redirect Robotic Mission in 2021. There are thousands of near-Earth asteroids, and we can only learn so much about these objects from robotic exploration. Sending people to an asteroid is still outside our capabilities, but maybe we can bring part of one here. NASA is working on a plan to visit a nearby asteroid with a probe and bring a piece of it back. The Asteroid Redirect Robotic Mission is currently planned for a 2021 launch, but there's still a lot of planning that needs to be done. The probe would land on an asteroid and pick up a 4-meter rock. The mission could also include an analysis of gravity deflection, testing to see if the mass of the probe and rock can affect the orbit of the asteroid. The rock would pose no danger to Earth if it were to get away on the return trip. The idea is that it could be deposited in orbit of the Moon and astronauts could study it later. Number 4, NASA returns to the Moon in 2024. NASA eventually hopes to send a crewed mission to Mars. But before that, the agency plans to return astronauts to the Moon and build a lunar base there. They want to send humans to the Moon again by 2024. Those would be the first boots on the lunar surface since the Apollo mission that ended over 45 years ago. This time, NASA wants to build a moon-orbiting space station with a reusable lunar landing system. NASA stands on the verge of commercializing low-Earth orbit. These experiences and partnerships will enable NASA to go back to the moon in 2024, and this time they plan to stay there. NASA is laying the foundation that will eventually enable human exploration of Mars. The moon will provide a proving ground to test technologies and resources that will take humans to Mars and beyond, including building a sustainable reusable architecture. The idea is that the lunar base could allow for more in-depth scientific research of the moon and potentially even enable us to mine resources there that could be converted to fuel for further space travel. Number 3, Breakthrough Starshot Mission in 2036. This could be the most exciting mission of this century. The breakthrough initiatives were announced to the public on 20 July 2015 at London's Royal Society by late physicist Stephen Hawking. Russian tycoon Yuri Milner created the initiatives to search for intelligent extraterrestrial life in the universe and consider a plan for possibly transmitting messages out into space. Since Apollo 11's moonshot, we have been sending our machines to planets, comets, and even interstellar space. But with current rocket technology, it would take thousands of years to reach our neighboring star system. In the last decade and a half, rapid technological advances have opened up the possibility of light-powered space travel at a significant fraction of light speed. This involves a ground-based light beamer pushing miniature space probes attached to light sails to speeds of up to 100 million miles an hour. Such a system would allow a flyby mission to reach Alpha Centauri in just over 20 years from its launch. They will launch 1,000 tiny light sail spacecraft called Starships on a four-light-year journey to Alpha Centauri at 20% of the speed of light using lasers on Earth. The mission hopes to test the possibility of ultra-fast space travel and will fly by Proxima Centauri b, an Earth-like planet which is in the habitable zone of its star system. Number 2, NASA's Dragonfly mission to Titan in 2026. Titan is the largest moon of Saturn and the second largest natural satellite in the solar system. It is the only moon known to have a dense atmosphere and the only known body in space, other than Earth, where clear evidence of stable bodies of surface liquid has been found. This is a highly anticipated mission to Saturn's icy moon. The spacecraft is scheduled to launch in 2026 and is expected to arrive at Titan in 2034. It will then begin to study the moon's wide variety of environments. Because Titan's atmosphere is so dense, almost four times that of Earth. Dragonfly will be able to carry its entire science payload to different locations around the ocean world for the 2.7-year mission. Titan has been likened to an early Earth analog, so scientists hope the mission will inform our understanding of how life evolved here on our home planet. Number 1, NASA's mission to Mars in 2030s. NASA is aiming to send people to Mars by 2030s. But honestly, this mission could be delayed as all the design work for the mission still needs to be done, from what the rocket will look like to how food will be grown on Mars. 
It currently only takes three days to get to the moon, but in a worst-case scenario, the Mars mission could take two years. Scientists also need to work out how to protect Mars astronauts from prolonged exposure to solar and cosmic radiation. Another issue is that current plant system models for sustainable food are not suitable to take to Mars because they're too big. Whatever it is, I hope we get to Mars as soon as possible. Which mission are you excited about? Let us know in the comment section.